Cosmo Instruments, LS, R700 with option J. Procedure for measuring the equivalent internal volume. This video explains how to measure the equivalent internal volume KVE using a leak master for the LS, R700 with option J. Select the R icon in the lower right corner of the screen. Press the Enter key to unlock settings. Press Yes to switch to manual mode. First, connect a non-leaking work and check there are no leaks on the work side. Press the Start key to perform leak test. Now that you have confirmed that there are no leaks, perform the KVE automatic setup. Press the menu key on the keyboard to display the menu screen. Select the KVE. Select the basic settings. Make sure that leak master has been selected for the calibrator. Make sure that three phase has been selected for the KVE setup behavior. Enter the LM flow rate. Move the cursor to the entry field of LM flow rate. Enter the flow value of the leak master. This time we will use a leak master that leaks 20 milliliters per minute at 100 kilopascals, so enter 20. Select with the enter key and use the cursor keys to enter a value. After entering, press the back key twice. Select the KVE automatic setup. Remove the sealing plug of the calibration port in the lower right corner of the tester. Connect the leak master with the value you just entered. Press the start key to start three automatic measurements. The first measurement is a warm-up. In the second time, only the work is measured and the differential pressure generated by the work is measured. In the third time, the cal valve for the leak master connected to the calibration port opens. Measure while generating a leak of the 20 milliliters per minute you just set from the leak master. The raw differential pressure value was displayed as 585.1 pascals. From this value, the value obtained in the second measurement is subtracted. The KVE will be automatically calculated based Press the back key and ensure that KVE settings has been selected. Select the basic settings and confirm that the field of KVE value contains the value you just entered. Now that the KVE value has been measured, change the leak unit to a flow unit. Use the back key or menu key to go to the menu screen. Select the settings and select the advanced settings. Then, select the unit. Change the leak unit from PA to ML slash MIN, etc. Remove the leak master from the calibration port and connect the plug firmly. Press the start key to start leak test.
the unit was confirmed to be a flow unit. This work was found to have a leak of 0.21 milliliters per minute. This concludes the video LS, R700 with option J, procedure for measuring equivalent internal volume. Thank you for watching.